Looks good. All right, I'm just about set up right here, too. Chris, you sure you want to stick around? I mean, this is, uh, our project. What, miss my beautiful girl make medical history? Absolutely not. All right, all the cameras are set up and running. I, um, I set them to lock the footage by the hour, which should give you guys a bit more precision. Thank you, baby. Aw, oh, for you? Anything. Come on, guys. Safety first. Let's get this show on the road. <clears throat> Peter, are you sure you want to do this? We could go to Professor Ross and have him reconsider. Or maybe we can even go to the board this time. Kim, I'm not going to put my project in, our project in jeopardy. We will not be shut down again by some senile old man or some faceless bureaucrats. Not this time. Wait, you guys have done this before? Only on animals. And there were no side effects and no complications. Wait, no, hold on. What did, why did Ross stop you guys? Because he's a senile old man and he's living behind the times. Peter, I have a really bad feeling about this. If I wanted you to contradict me every step of the goddamn way, I would have hired someone a little more competent than you, like a lab tech. Whoa, hey, cool it, Wheels. Th this is still really special for all of us, okay? Not just you. My name is Peter. Fine. Peter. Do it. Ministering E-407. Hold on to your butts, boys. Administering sedative. Got to be kidding me. We're going to be famous. Phase one initiated. So let me get this straight. <laughs> you two nerds. Adapted a form of the flu with various types of new DNA code. Is that right? Well, that's an extreme oversimplification, but yeah. And it makes one of these cocoon thingies whenever its host is asleep. While within the cocoon, the virus forces the body into a sort of hyperdrive, healing almost anything. Oh, your brain is so sexy. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> what? Can a man be turned on by his girlfriend's beautiful mind? I can think of some other things to turn you on. Oh, yeah? <laughs> What? Maybe we shouldn't do this. Are you kidding? I don't think we should do this with all these cameras around. What? Why? Come on, we'll put it on tape. We'll watch it later. It'll be fun. Chris, this is my future here. I'm not going to jeopardize This is because of Peter, isn't it? What are you talking about? You can keep me out of the loop about all this cocoon crap as much as you want. You can have all your little inside jokes with wheels over there. But Kim, show me some fucking respect. 
Okay? Where are you going? Breakfast. Walk, Peter. Peter? Oh, slowly, slowly. Is it, is it tingling? Anything? Ow. There's pain. There's pain. There's pain. <laughs> Fine again. It's like he didn't even hit you. Yes. Yes. Uh, it's all healed. He didn't mean it, you know. He just thought something went wrong. Whatever. It doesn't matter. It's all over now, anyways. You okay? I'm okay. 
I just wanted to check in on you. Anyway, he's gonna be wondering where I'm at. So. No, don't go. What is it? I, I love you. Peter? What are we doing? This... I, I can't do this. I'm gonna go to a hotel. Kim, wait. I'm sorry. I'm glad you're okay. I'm sorry. But I just can't let you go. I'd find you here. Where's Pete? And why the fuck are you wearing his clothes, Kim? Kim. Answer me! He's out. Running. Running. Is that what you two call it? Running? Whatever we call it, it's better than anything you could ever toss at me! Is this how you want this to be? Huh, Kim? Have you just been waiting to fuck him the whole time? No! I didn't wait. And even in a wheelchair, he's a better lay than you could ever be! Fuck! Just <laughs> fucking bitch! No! Fuck! <laughs> Kim? Kim? Kim, are you in there? Oh my god. What the fuck did he do to you? Yes, my love. We shall be one, all of us.